YouTube, what's going on? It's Mesa back at it with some Destiny 2. Alright, I am really hoping Xur has brought the goods today because every exotic Engram I've gotten this week has given me old stuff. Quick PSA guys, I'll be streaming tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern, the new Raid Lair, because I have a nasty toothache and, um, yeah, I gotta go see the dentist right now. Well, he did bring one thing new. Uh, and we got here, okay, five of swords. So you want to trade in your um, rare Nightfall uh, challenge card and buy this. Uh, it costs nothing. And now you could supposedly add more modifiers to it. So let's go take a look in here. Yeah, okay, so you can throw in all the different... All right, so we got burns right here. Here we've got some uh, advantages and you've got some disadvantages. And you can really customize your whole uh, Nightfall experience. All right, so let's take a look and see what he's got. Now, he's got a Faded Anger. I'm supposed to buy that on a character that you are, are needing something on. So I'm going to save this for my Warlock. My Warlock is like 355, almost 360. I think he's 360 right now. My Huntress here, she's only 351. I just started it last started her last night. Uh, the only thing that's new is Ashen Wake, and I just did a review on it this morning. Watch my video, link in the description and top comment, where I review the Sleeper Simulant and this thing. So bring the heat. Fusion Grenades now explode on impact and gain increased throw speed. So you throw them really fast. And yeah, they don't stick to things, they actually blow up. So watch my review, uh, it's uh, linked in the description. All right, Knucklehead Radar for the Hunter. So it gives you a uh, third eye, provides radar while aiming, either your energy or your kinetic. We've got the Prometheus Lens. Now, the Prometheus Lens got a little bit of a buff. I don't have the uh, patch notes here, but um, I know they increased, oh, okay, they increased the actual burn damage. So like when you're laying into a target, and you start seeing that like fireball on the target, that does more damage, and I think they buffed the, uh, the ammo in it. So, uh, fires a solar trace beam that generates a damaging heat field that grows while the weapon is uh, the w while the weapon continues to fire. Kills with this weapon return a fraction of the ammo used to the magazine. Extends the beam's duration. Extending the beam's duration. Vesper of Radius. I love this thing. Buy this for your warlock. Rifts release an arc shockwave when cast, but that's not why I like it. Rift energy recharges faster when you are surrounded by enemies. Did a full review on this a while back. Basically, if you've got two or more ads around you, you're going to see that Rift Energy come back really quickly. So it's good for Horde-type things, Escalation Protocol, definitely the uh, Callus Throne Room. When you've got all the dogs, I can get dogs roaming around on the bottom. I could usually get, I don't know, I think three Rifts, uh, one for, yeah, I can get a Rift on three of the plates, not four. So anyway, uh, I'm going to buy these anyway for my Titan, just to have them. But watch my review, uh, link in the description, got a usual three of coins. I'm using these and I'm not seeing anything here. But I'm going to open this up on my uh, Warlock. Well, man, it's not showing anything new. I haven't gotten anything. I swear, this week, nothing new for me. All right, guys. Babble mode's engaged. I'm going to the dentist right now. I got a nasty toothache. And that's it. So see you tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern. I'll be streaming with WTF Game Nation, but I'll be streaming right here live on YouTube. That's it, guys. Do me a favor. Drop a like in this video. Only if you see fit. Follow me on the Twitter, at Mesa Sean. Check out my stream. Usually and always on YouTube. And that's it. I'm out of here like Vladimir.